Hello, hello everyone. I am Darkness and welcome back to what remains of Edith Finch. Um, I don't know if I'm going to finish it in this one or if I'm going to uh, have a little bit more to do after this. Um, mostly because um, I, I'm afraid that if I try to like wrap it up, uh, too quickly. It's just gonna feel all rushed and this, then the other. And oh boy, found the next one, Sam's. And we're talking. Yep, Marine. Okay. Semper Sam spent his life shooting photos, but Mom said he got nervous being in front of the camera. I guess we're all afraid of something. Hmm. So was he hurt? So, uh, mm, he got hurt. Instead of hiding from death, Sam seemed to go out of his way to meet it. <laughs> it's not necessarily how that goes when you have a sense of duty. It is dark. Okay. A wife? All right. I think. I think that's all before. And it, it's just baffling that every single room is sealed. After every... Was the mom expecting one day that the house would just go away? Why'd she give her the key then? Selfie. What? Dawn, I promise you'll never forget this weekend. Yes, sir. These memories are going to last a lifetime. Mm -hmm. Am I going to have to shoot anything? It's a hunting trip, Don. Shooting is strongly encouraged. Don't shoot the propane. Shouldn't we be leaving? Just want to get a shot of you, Don. Then we can take off. What? Perfect. Hmm. It's going to rain the whole weekend, isn't it? I will never forget this weekend, Dad. That's the spirit. Okay, got it. I'm going to take some pictures, okay? Just be careful. The camera's older than you are. Hmm. Definitely should not have drunk all that coffee. Hey! <laughs> That's a keeper. I'm just saying, I'm not always going to be here, Don. You'll need to remember this stuff, if you want to survive. I'll be fine, Dad. You know who else thought he was going to be fine? Some guy who died. Don, I'm being serious. I know, Dad. You're always serious. Doesn't being out here make you want to chill out? Well, to tell you the truth, I haven't been out here in 20 years. Don, don't you think you could find something more interesting to photograph? Wait, where is it? Doesn't Last that make time her? I was with my brother Calvin. Man, that was a great trip. Your grandpa's fan taught us how to fish, how to build a fire. <laughs> we found an old logging trail with deer everywhere. Where is the girl? I bet if I could remember where that trail was, we'd spot a buck for you in no time. She's a finch too, isn't she? Give me a minute to check the map. What is more interesting? Dad! Good eyes, Don. Hmm. Before you take the shot, let me get a picture of you. 
I don't like the sinister music. Great shot, Don! <laughs> I'm proud of you, Don. Always remember that, okay? Dad, it's twitching. I think That's it's... That's totally so normal, Don. Just focus on the camera. Try not to think about... Dad! Oh! these stories, that's the one I wish most that my mom had told me. Why? Milton's gonna be the last one, isn't it? Sanjay? San Sanjay? Why is that one up there? Gus Gregory Lewis. Um, Don. Edie. Sven is, might as well be filled in already. Um, it's the one story that's realistic. There's nothing about a curse. It's a bad set of circumstances. Wow. Come on. This labyrinthian house. After Sam died, my mom and Edie got really close. They'd both lost a lot. The child get... Okay. Each of these stories ends in death, by the way. Um, so, there's no getting a break from it. I can't imagine my mom ever writing poetry, and yet... A poem for Gus. My mom moved up to the loft after her brothers died. At the time, it was as far away as she could get. <sighs> I can go back to those stories, can but... Can you imagine what it was like for her to lose two sons after she'd already lost two brothers? She spent a summer building houses in Calcutta, where she met my dad, Sanjay. Where is Sanjay? In 1986. Fly to India. Religion was another thing my mom never talked about, but I think it helped her a lot after her dad died. So, just as long as we don't have to make me cover the... We're going to have to cover this, aren't we? We sure as hell are. We're going to have to cover the death of a one-year-old. They're all from the perspective of the person who died. Okay. C. 
Sam got divorce papers. Petitioner Kate filing is year twenty. It's for the death, isn't it? No, it can't be. Why? Dear Kay, do you remember the way Gregory used to laugh when he thought he was alone? Like something funny was happening, but only he could see it. Divorce after the death of his son. That is really, really common. I think he saw things the rest of us don't. Do not tell me it was in the bathtub. Where are the parents? Where are the parents? Where are the parents? Watch hand over, Gregory. It's time to... No. Hold on, sweetie. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No! I told you I don't want to talk right now. What? No! Don't close the sliding door and get on the phone! Oh, I'm the frog. I got the whale in here. Whale of a good time. This is gonna end tragically. Please come back to the bathtub instead of fighting. Please come back to the bathtub. Who leaves a child unattended? Please say that she was incarcerated for this. happening that I worried about a baby being too happy Are they all gotta jump out when I jump out No, no, no. Don't turn the water back on. No! I wish you could have told us about the world we saw. You left him in a bathtub!
That doesn't feel fair. It doesn't matter if there's a phone call. Don't want him to... for Gus, who always said the wedding was a bad idea. Our father never hit us kids, at least not very hard, before the day my brother said with teenage disregard that he'd be dead before he'd see a wedding in our yard. Teenager? Harder to control than it looks. My father made him come, of course, but Gus stood far apart, just flew his kite and bottled up the storm inside his heart. I tried to talk him out of it, but though he'd never met her, we don't need a stepmom, were the words that I I now heard. pronounce you husband and wife. Make him cry. Where's the actual si- It looks like it should be happening right there. Can you crash it into people? They don't care. Okay, that's Odin. photos came, Dad ordered him to come, come here. here. But Gus declined, and as a sign, held up his middle finger. He wasn't happy. Understandably, all kids take that differently. The wind picked up, and panicked geese appeared and quickly went. But all the humans did that day was go inside the tent. What? The rain came down in buckets then, but no one seemed afraid that nature might destroy the tent our dad had crudely made. The thunder sounded much too close and full of angry power. But all my father said to this was, Make the music louder. I wish that I could truly say I thought about you on that day. Out there on the beach alone. Just you, the wind, the sea, and foam. But I didn't. Until we found you. She never talked about him, but Mom told me once if I was a boy, they were going to name me Gus. Okay, Uncle, Uncle Walter, Sam is grandpa, right? She's, so Sam's her grandpa, her mom had Gus, uh, brothers Gus and Gregory, and then she had two children, Lewis and Milton. So that was Sam and Kay having a conversation to lose Gregory. Gus was born earlier than that, uh, and... The storm, the tent, every all the debris kill them. Well, Milton seems to be some like some unaccounted for mystery. Do I need to climb back up? Can I do it faster this time? No, I'm preggers. I cannot do it faster. That is the thing about preggers. You gotta, gotta be aware that 
is you are working on pregnant time, which the more preggers you are, then it's, it's I, I I've from experience of observing and knowing that I didn't want to die from getting my head bit off because I was like, hurry up and the, don't 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 say that, don't say that. All right, so that's all here, I guess. Do these work? Alright. Might be a shorter one because I do... I do want to have time to kind of go over the story. It's this. I know it's a story about death, pretty much. But at the same time, um, the way it's told, it's um, it feels more than that. Like this isn't going to be it. It's not going to stop with just how people died. I guess that was her mom shooting the buck, and Sam getting. Her, her dad died in front of her. I don't understand necessarily where to go next. It didn't give me... It didn't give me much to go on in there. Um... All I ever think of is backtracking when I don't know where to go, but... I mean, this is where I came from, right? So I don't need to go back over there. Okay. Backtracking, probably bad idea. And inspect environment a little bit more and see where the next secret door leads. And try to find the next Narnia. Yeah, that's probably what I'm supposed to do. Alright, so if each room has been leading to a new room, then I missed the door. Because they've been pretty good about that, keeping it linear and, you know, the the few times that they had, like, going to the basement where they had me backtrack a little bit, they, they made it obvious in the story previously that it's where I need to go. Saving. Okay. Dawn stuff is up there. Strength, respect. Where would I put the next hidey hole to crawl into? Raise flag, breakfast, quiet time, duties dawn, sweet trash, Gus mop. Greg, be a baby. Huh. There's got to be something up that I mean, I have to have missed it, right? So, they're, they're the two stories at the bottom, and then it would have had me come up here and read um, some more about Dawn, if I had just done it more linear linearly. So, the, uh, me taking it out of order probably made me miss something about being up here. Something that I... Wouldn't have... Yep, yeah, it sure did. My mom moved to India a week after graduation and got a job teaching English. Lewis was born a year later. Lewis. When my dad died, I don't think mom knew where else to go. I'm sure Edie was happy to have her back. How did he die? Lewis M Milton. And to see kids in the house again.
The house had to get a little bigger, but Edie was used to that. Had to get a little bigger? If you never take out rooms? Yeah, sure. And for a while, things were good. Almost normal. But it didn't last. The Curse. A school project by... Am I looking at a school product project that Edie did or Edith that I'm playing as did? I'm assuming me. Because yes, so mom's mom homeschooled us and right? So Edith's stuff is still there. So that is Edith's project. Uh, project. She's the baby, and Dad died. Beginning of the end was Milton's tenth birthday, when Edie gave him a castle. Looking into Milton After now. After Milton disappeared, the only thing he left behind was a room full of paintings. From the roof. It's the only way to get in, isn't it? We'll tackle Milton's story, and then I think the next one will be the uh, last. Uh, I, is what I'm thinking. Oh, just going through the window. Yeah. Why? Why even bother sealing up the door when the window is right there? Yeah, why even... It looked like a pole from the outside. I thought I was going to have to zip line in here pretty much. Or a slide or... An architect's mind. Yeah. Castle. You paint it everywhere. Why? Why, though? Milton Finch in The Magic Paintbrush. Definitely talented. That young of an age. I was four when Milton disappeared. Disappeared though, but what? What does that mean? The magic paintbrush? He just, he went through a door and never came back? Milton... There's more to the house. I don't... That's his whole story? It's not Mom it. spent months searching for my brother. Then she sealed the doors. I think Edie was happy to finally have another painter in the family. Whatever Milton had found in the house, Mom didn't want it getting out. 
whatever Milton had found, the magic door. He found a door in the house? And was never found? It is, is that what I am to understand? Mom definitely blamed Edie, but I think Lewis blamed himself. After he graduated, he just spent more and more time in his room. Until Mom got him a job at the cannery. Everyone always told me to stay out of Lewis's room. Except Lewis. Hmm. Oof. This, this, this house is not... This should, this house should not have been built. This is not a good design. People were bound to die here. He could have just fallen off of the the thing and gone into the sea. No one would have found that. Okay. We will explore Lewis's room because we're at the top of the house. Um, and so if we look at the what's filled in... Um, so mom isn't filled in... Or husband. K is just a side note to Sam. So I don't think uh, Sanjay, Sanjay, Sanjay. Edie, Don, Lewis. They're not in here. And I think that they're kind of the key to knowing if this is actually a curse. Um, I, I mean, it doesn't... I don't know. I'm going to have to think about it uh, in between. Uh, but thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying it. This story has got got me thinking a lot. So um, I'm, not, I'm not sure how to necessarily feel quite yet. But I'm going to probably finish it in the next one. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying and I hope to see you back here for the hopefully last part of What Remains of Edith Finch really, really soon. Bye!